about how you come up with your original designs because uh, this is is it all designed by you in this yes. in the store? So there you have it. That's all original designs. When you come up with a concept, you start with a sketch, right? That's right. That's the first uh, step is the sketch that you put your ideas on paper. And then from that, then you develop a pattern. Right. As we design. take a look at those sketches now and uh, some, really, some really creative things. So how many sketches will you do if you do a sketch? Are there some that you just throw away and say, no, I, it's not going to work. It's not practical. Well, uh, I usually don't throw them away, even if it's, I don't want to produce them mm -hmm. right away, because you never know, it's, that idea might be uh, a good idea for later on, and, but I would do uh, maybe 150 to 200 sketches per week, right. and that's the fun part of designing, it's create new ideas, and, uh, but there's so much that we can produce, so usually I pick from the sketch that I do, I pick the one that I really yeah. care about it and to, to produce them. It's important to note too that uh, I know that a lot of very famous people from around the world have, have shopped with your clothing but the uh, average person can come in too, right? It's not because it, it, when you come in it does feel a little bit exclusive but at the same time you can get great clothes made oh, for yes. you. Yes, and uh, no matter shape of, uh, you know like often people will think that we just dress a very slim uh, person but mm -hmm. not at all. A person with, like a larger Woman could mm -hmm. look as w good as any you know small woman or any model. So it's uh, if the the clothes are made for you and fit you, and if it's according to your personality, it will look great. You can work the magic. That's what it's oh, all about. Yes, and <laughs> that's the fun part of to to be a designer. We're gonna have some fun too with a little bit of a fashion show coming up uh, with Richard Robinson. Kurt, we're looking forward to uh, seeing uh, some of those clothes in action. Always good to see the unveiling of the new fashions, eh? Yes. That's good. Oh, just some of those beautiful ties here at Richard Robinson's uh, beautiful shop as well. A lot has changed over the many years that uh, Richard has been doing this, and we're going to take a look at some of the fashions. Uh, as you can see, I am all outfitted in uh, in some an outfit with flair, I should say, right? Right. Yes. Uh, now, you, uh, it's important to mention that uh, for for men, you can uh, custom for any any event they may have, or even everyday work uh, clothing. That's right. right? Yeah. 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 We do for men as well as for ladies. Yes. And uh, so, b basically, the rule of thumb is to come see you, and you'll work it out for them. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> so let's take a look at some of of, of the uh, the lines that you have in, uh, and uh, maybe you can introduce us to your models and talk about the clothing yeah. they wear. Here's uh, my house model Khadija that uh, is wearing a two piece suit. Beautiful. In. Uh, Oh, I like the uh, touch on the back there. Uh -huh. Yes, and, and you can see the, 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 you know, the difference between uh, going to a store in a mall and obviously coming here. That yes. uh, the the design touches are, yeah. are key. And you see, if uh, clients want that ensemble in in red leather, we can do that in any wow. fabric. And what's in metal uh, could be produced in the silver or gold or even in leather. So wow. it's the choice of the client to. That's beautiful, and uh, again, the the fit is uh, really really nicely cut, uh -huh. as you uh, could clearly tailor it to right. her her body specifications. That's right. right. We uh, we fit the garment according to the body of the client, and uh, well, thank and you uh, to Kadisha. And uh, the next, next one is uh, Liz. Wow, and she's wearing a cocktail ensemble. That is great. So you would wear that this when? Forgive me for being uh, a little bit. If you go for a cocktail, <laughs> or right. if it's a a less formal evening. Wow. You can wear the uh, that, and this stuff also come with uh, if the person prefer pants. Right. We have the pants as well as the skirt, and uh, and the skirt could be short or long depending of the the occasion. So when you see the, the front, it's kind of it's kind of cool that uh, in the in the front uh, you can see that it's a bit conservative. And then boom, in the back, That's it's got right. that pop, right? Yeah. So then you you really get that evening I, wear feel. I like to to always do some nice interesting design you know at the back as well because most of the detail on a garment are always at the front right so back are usually boring but I like to do a little uh, <laughs> detail at the back that will it's kind of like the uh, the bait and switch so you you get almost judge a book by its cover and then 
uh, uh, behind it's, it's, right. it's totally it's, uh, it's totally different because the uh, uh, often like when uh, like especially for weddings mm -hmm. like if uh, uh, the mother of the bride or mother of the groom are walking the aisle and they have an interesting design at the front but the people see them from the back too so it's interesting that they see nice uh, cut at the back as well and you specialize in formal wear right that's right like here Khadija she's wearing a, an evening gown wow in a swakardi oh, that is beautiful look and, at that um, and that dress could be done in, in any color as well right. and it could be a dress for a ball or a graduation or as a wedding dress too you right know, if a bride Absolutely. wants to to have that look that is beautiful yeah she looked really nice <laughs> and she have a nice back eh? oh yeah well that helps right <laughs> it does help to have a to have a nice back to show uh -huh. off <laughs> And All that right. dress could also be produced short if a person wants uh, yeah, to Yeah, at any dress. length. That's right. Always complementing your specifications That's as well. Right. Uh, and uh, finally, we have oh, Liz wow. here in the, another evening gown in silk for ply. And you can see that that's a much uh, slimmer fit and at the end, the flare there. That's right. That is beautiful. And it's interesting at the back to see the gore in chiffon. Yes. Wow. And... Um, that's gorgeous. Well, just beautiful stuff here, Richard. Uh, very, very well done. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, from somebody who, uh, who doesn't know anything, I do recognize uh, beautiful clothing. There's no question about that. Uh, Kurt, that is some nice uh, couture here at yeah. Richard Robertson's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Anyway, uh, we are just thinking, Jeff, mm -hmm. you know, if you, uh, if you stopped using the Grecian formula, <laughs> you'd look much like Richard Robinson. Yeah, I think uh, the, the hairdos, right? Yeah, yeah so if you so eased off from now? the Grecian formula, the GF... That's right. Yeah, <laughs> you'd be in business. Huh? So you, a young again. version. Ah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> yes, a younger version on the left there. With the Excellent. zero talent. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks.